Hello dear students how are you all I hope you all are fine and enjoying good health Dear students in our previous sessions we have discussed about different kinds of animals we have discussed about land animals water animals amphibians we have also discussed about their food and shelter now students today we will discuss about their babies as you all know animals are living beings and all living beings can reproduce means they can give birth to their young ones so before we start let's discuss the difficult words with their meanings so our first word is b a b i e s babies means kids number 2 p a r e n t s parents means father and mother number 3 S A F E safe means free from danger next is P O U C H pouch means a small bag next is C O S Y cozy means warm and number 6 is N E S T L I N G S nestlings means young birds not yet old enough to leave the nest Now dear students open page number 31 of your enjoying science book and let's start reading lesson 9 animal babies all animals have babies babies means kids the babies look mostly like their parents parents means father and mother most animals look after their babies they feed them they keep them safe safe means free from danger Now kids as our parents look after us they provide us good food and shelter they protect us similarly animals also protect their babies from their enemies they provide them food and shelter now read next a cow is licking her calf now have a look at this picture Here you can see a cow is licking its calf. A cow's baby is called a calf. Now come to the next line. Nestlings means young birds not yet old enough to leave the nest. So nestlings in a nest. Here you can see some beautiful nestlings in their nest. Their mother is feeding them. Read next. A mother monkey is carrying her baby. Have a look. Here we can see a mother monkey is carrying its baby. They both are playing together. Now come to next line. Baby snakes are coming out of eggs. Here you can see a baby snake is coming out of its egg. Now next is a baby goat is called a kid. I will look like a frog only when I grow up. Do you know students what we are talking about? See in this picture. Here you can see a tadpole, and a tadpole will grow up as a frog. See the growth of a tadpole. What is written next? A tadpole means a baby frog is swimming in water. Now read next. A joy means kangaroo's baby in its mother's pouch. Pouch means a small bag. And joy is saying, "I am so cozy." means i am so warm now see here we can see a joy with its mother kangaroo now dear kids let's revise some animals and their babies so our first animal is cow and its baby is called calf after cow is frog and its baby is called tadpole next is kangaroo and its baby is called joy afterwards sheep Sheep's baby is called lamb. Next is duck and duck's baby is duckling. Now let's revise some more animals and their babies. So our next animal is cat and its baby is called kitten. Next is bear, lion, tiger and its baby is called cub. Lion's baby, tiger's baby and bear's baby is called a cub. Next is elephant. As cow's baby is called a calf, same way an elephant's baby is also called a calf. 
नेक्स्ट एनिमल इज हॉर्स एंड इट्स बेबी इज कॉल्ड कोल्ट और फोल नाउ इज डेयर एंड इट्स बेबी इज कॉल्ड फॉन आफ्टर दिस हैन हैंड्स बेबी इज कॉल्ड चिक एंड नेक्स्ट एनिमल इज डॉग योर फेवरेट पेट एनिमल एंड इट्स बेबी इज पपी सो डियर किड्स इट इज ऑल फॉर टूडे नाउ रिवाइज चैप्टर एनिमल बेबीज टिल देन बाय बाय हैव अ नाइस डे थैंक यू